Greetings, I'm Mark Wiley and I'm going to be sharing with you the art of integrated eschrema in this new video series. Thank you for joining me and I'd like us to take a look at what is integrated eschrema and all the things that are going to be coming up during the following tapes. Integrated eschrema is a pan-Philippine martial art. That is a Filipino martial art, which we call now FMA is the common term, that is derived from systems and teachers from the northern Luzon to Mindanao from the top to the bottom of the islands, is an art that encompasses much of the DNA of the Philippine systems without being stuck on a particular style. Although there are uh, seven specific systems that make up a good part of the techniques within this system. And these systems I learned directly from uh, seven specific masters. And they are uh, Remy Presas, Grandmaster Remy Presas from Modern Arnis, Grandmaster Herminio Binas from the Binas Dynamic Arnis System from Bacolod. Uh, Angel Cabalas, Grandmaster Cabalas of the Cabalas Serrata Escrima System. Professor V, Florindo Visitacion from V Arnis Jitsu. Grandmaster Ramiro Estelilia of the Estelilia Cabarawan Escrima. Grandmaster Benjamin Luna Lima, Lightning Scientific Arnis. And Tatan Antonio Listrissimo of the Calis Listrissimo System. Now, integrated eschrema is not a composite of the techniques that make up their styles, although certainly it is composed of those techniques and techniques from other styles and the other 30 plus teachers that I've trained with in the Philippine arts in the United States and in the Philippines. What makes integrated eschrema unique is that we look for the through line, the building blocks of the DNA, if you will, of the Philippine arts and of every component of the FMA styles. So when we learn footwork, we learn many methods of footwork. What range it's used in, what gait, how does it move you between different areas. When we look at strikes, it's not just 12 angles of attack, but there's 13 striking methods. There's categories and groupings of striking techniques. Uh, and there's energies of how to use the strikes and body dynamics uh, in use of those strikes. There's footwork and the strikes combined together. That's very important. Modes of defense is maybe a new word that you're not used to hearing, uh, which are styles of defense, of which there are four in all the Philippine arts. All the techniques fall into the four modes, and we'll talk about those in another, another segment. All of these things with the timing, the footwork, the modes, the reins, the gates, these are the DNA of the system. This provides the integration of these methods. You have the small, smallest units of them, and they're put together to make broader units. Uh, not just memorization of loose techniques. Certainly the individual techniques you will see and say, yeah, we have that technique or we have something like that technique. And of course, integrated eschrema, um, the content is the same. Uh, the content, the techniques are all the same. All the Philippine arts have a shared content, but the context in which it is understood, learned, trained, taught, and practiced is different. So I ask that you have an open mind that you see if you can come to new understandings or a light bulb goes off for you or you just dismiss it. Either way, I uh, hope you enjoy this journey along with me in Integrated Eskrima. Thank you.